It is being reported that the El Nino climate phenomena will return later this year in 2023, making it very likely the world, making it very likely the world will exceed 1.5 degrees Celsius of warming. The hottest year in recorded history was in 2016, driven by a major El Nino in that year. Our region is expected to experience heat waves and much higher than usual rainfall. This is where leadership and visibility pay off. The credibility of who we are and what we are saying and doing lend persuasive weight to securing that deal. Our efforts to establish trade in carbon credits and our plans to transition to reliance on renewable energy should, be, should also significantly help our economic position so that we are able to pursue national development at the rate and scale which we all aspire to. We are moving ahead to build new hospitals. We have expanded physical capacity in our clinics and human capacity by hiring more doctors and nurses. Mindful of the need to treat nurses fairly and respectfully so that they practice their calling at home, we have also signed new industrial agreements with the Bahamas Nurses Union, which includes salary increases and, more importantly, retention bonuses.